Hey folks, Joe Morales with Tiffin Motorhomes here, standing in a brand new 2021-25 RW. Let me be the first to welcome you to the life of roughing it smoothly. What we're going to go over in this video is we're going to go over a couple of features available with the house radio. Your house radio will play music in your awning speakers. It will also play music in a soundbar that's located towards the rear of your coach above your television. For the first part of this uh, demonstration, we're going to put the radio on and we're going to hear the music coming out of the, uh, the awning. And the second part is we'll be going back towards the soundbar and we're going to show you uh, the music coming out from the radio through the soundbar. We're also going to show you how you're able to link up your favorite device, Apple device, Android device via, to via Bluetooth so that you're able to play that music if it's on your iPad, your iPhone, whatever it may be. So for the first part of this, what we're going to do is we're going to remove the protective cover. At the top here is a red button. I'm going to hit that on. You'll see the word welcome when you turn it on. The radio will automatically tune back to the station that it was at when it was turned off. So we already have music coming out of the awning. I'm going to turn the volume up just a couple of notches here. Volume buttons are here along with several other function buttons above it. I'm going to open the door and you can hear the music that's coming out of the awning speakers. So that's it's that simple as far as getting the music for your awning speakers. Now to get the music from the uh, the soundbar over the TV we are going to be using the soundbar remote for that operation and if you'll give me a couple of seconds to get everything set up we'll continue with part two of this demonstration. Be right back. Hi everybody, Joe Morales again. Welcome to part two about the operations for the house radio located inside the 25RW. Now what we're going to do is we're going to run the house radio to the sound bar. Then after that, we're going to link it up to a Bluetooth device. So, first thing you're going to do, you're going to take the sound bar of remote, turn it on. You'll see that the sound bar has black, blinking white lights and will go to a single light in the middle. The color of that light depends on what function you're in. Now, for the radio portion, we want to be in the port in button. That is the second button located on the right, second button down. So we're going to hit the port in button. The lights will flash. Now, we're just going to hit the volume. And now the music that's playing out the radio is now playing in the sound bar in the back of your coach. It's really that simple. Again, volume is in the volume buttons are in the middle. You got the up and down volume button. And for the use on the radio, you want to make sure that the port in button is selected and you should have a green light in the middle. Now, I'm going to lower the volume all the way. And what we're going to do next is we're going to link up the sound bar to my Android to my iPhone. So what we're going to do is the third button down is a Bluetooth button. We're going to hit that button until you see a flashing blue button on the sound bar. Once the once you see that you'll see on your device available is an LG SK1. That's your soundbar. I'm going to select it and I've paired it with my phone and it is now connected. So now I want to listen to some music that's on my phone. I'm going to go to my music app, see what's one of the last things I had playing and we're going to turn that on and now that it's playing we're going to turn the volume up. Now the sound bar is playing the music from my iPhone. Again, you control the volume with the sound bar remote. Do not control the volume with your phone. Run all the volume through the sound bar remote. Fabulous little sound coming out of that little bar right there. So that's how you link up your phone, your tablet, 
or any other device that you have, even a gaming device, via Bluetooth to the sound, sound bar. Now, when you're done with using the sound bar and your device, you might want to make sure that you disconnect the device. The music will stop. And that way, anybody else in the coach who may be wanting to link up to the sound bar in the coach can do so. And there won't be double devices playing through it. So once again, to play the sound bar from the music coming out of the house radio, you're going to hit the port in button. And then you control the volume up and down with the sound bar remote. For Bluetooth, just hit the Bluetooth button, which is the third button down. Look for the device that says LG SK1 on your device. Pair it. Once it's paired, then you can just play your music off of your device through the sound bar. Hope this helps you out. If you need any further information, please check out the manufacturer's manuals that come with your, your coach in the owner information packet. If you should need further information after that, please don't hesitate to contact service here at the Winfield factory and they'll be more than happy to help you out. This is Joe Morales and I thank you for your time and we'll see you soon.